we are not going to review the scientific method in much detail since I assume you've been introduced to the scientific method before. However, I do want to address a common misconception about the scientific method and the term theory. In our everyday life, we use the word theory to describe an unsubstantiated assumption. In science, this is actually called a hypothesis. The word theory in our everyday life means hypothesis in the world of science. In science, a theory is not completely testable, but to gain the title of theory, a set of ideas must meet very, very rigorous criteria. There must be thousands of experiments or pieces of data that support a theory. There are relatively few theories in science because the criteria is so rigorous. So, when you are in your science class and you're taught about a theory, know that it has met the most rigorous criteria possible based on what scientists can test.